To say I feel accomplished is a major understatement. Good morning, guys. Hey, guys. We are getting ready to run a little errand. You gonna make us some coffee? Ah. My new coffee. Why do I need another cup of coffee? We are going to go pick up a bookshelf off of Facebook Marketplace. I have had my books partially on the bookshelf in my office, but also shoved into the closet in my office, like stacked in the shelves in the closet. It is very unusable. Precarious, to say the least. Precarious. <laughs> I don't use that word very often. What does precarious mean? It's like. Heffelty peffelty. Heffelty peffelty. Do you want to explain what that means? That means not, not put together. Not the best. Not the best. So we are going to go pick up this. Uh, I found a good deal on like an Ikea bookshelf, a marketplace. Pick that up and we're going to put it on the third floor, fill it up with books, give them a home. Let's have some coffee. This is the car that holds everything. It can hold bookcases and other things. We got the whole bookcase in here, which I did not expect. I was just planning to use ratchet straps up, out the back. And we were like, oh, it's almost in. We might as well put our seats forward, but now we're like in a little clown car. <laughs> it's not that bad though. Yeah, it's not too bad. Safely strapped in. So good. We've needed a bookcase for quite a while. All right, we are home and <laughs> we, we stopped at Aldi for a few groceries and then we just shoved them in the back of the bookcase. Well, Aldi was only taking cash. Well, so we thought. Well, they were only taking cash, but by the time we got to the register, their card was working again. But that's why we only got a few things. He was like, I'm in the mood for salad. And I was like, Oh, you ran out of waffle cones, so I'm gonna get you some more. So with the $30 cash, which this was not $30, but we, we could only buy selected items. And I apparently needed to stock up for an entire month on cream cheese. Oh, that, that's going well. Okay. <laughs> come on, come on. Oh yeah. Anyway, we went to the grocery store. Now we're gonna have some salad for dinner. The other day, Harry was sitting right here at this window, looking outside, looking very interested. And I think this is what he had seen out there that caught his interest. A little, I think, it's like a blue-tailed skink or something like that. Oh, bye-bye, uh, buddy. I think I was feeling like I needed salad for dinner oh. because I had leftover nachos oh, wait. for lunch. I thought you were going to tell them about last night. What was last night? Oh. <laughs> Yesterday was the 4th of July. And we didn't have any plans. We were kind of just having a quiet evening. But it came to about 9 o'clock at night. And we hadn't had any dinner. We were busy just doing house stuff. And so we decided, let's go. Where did we decide to go? I think we decided to go to Chipotle. Chipotle. And we looked online and there was one open till 10. So we were like, okay, let's go to that one. So we drive over there, they're closed. And on the way, and, and like on the way, I kind of noticed that a lot of places seem closed. I guess places closed for the 4th of July. I'm glad that people got got a break, but I didn't we didn't realize that places would be closed on the 4th of July. So we're like, okay, we'll go to Bojangles. Bojangles was closed. And so we went through the McDonald's drive-through. McDonald's was open and as we were going through the drive-through, it was magical. Fireworks. There were fireworks. Just like the drive-through was like the perfect view of the fireworks. So we were like, then yeah. We got our food, and we sat in the parking lot and watched the fireworks. 
it, it was actually pretty great. And, um, but the McDonald's last night combined with the nacho, leftover nachos for lunch, I was, I was ready for a salad. So that's what we're having. To say I feel accomplished is a major understatement. Okay. I, I think you should give a haul of your gift card. Okay. We were clean. I cleaned out the junk drawer, the junk cabinet, yeah. and I found a stack of old gift cards. And I, you better believe I am not throwing them away. So I called every single one and checked the balance. First, there was one. It was a clin card it was something that they used when i lived in boston when i did research studies that's how they compensated their patients or like reimbursed or however the wording is and so that was zero bummer but that's okay the next one is an at&t like i'm guessing it was like a phone reward or something there are two dollars and seven cents 207 so we'll take that. Um, this one is prepaid center visa. Again, I think it was probably a reward, 90 cents left. So we're close to $3, okay? Next is a Gap Banana Republic Old Navy gift card, $8.19. That'll buy something. This Lowe's store credit, it, I called to find out and they said, you have to go in the store to find out. I was like, what? <laughs> we live in the year 2021 and I have to go to the store to find out? Okay, next, this one is a, like it can be spent anywhere, Visa gift card, 2307. What, $23? Yes, and we do need, we do need to go to Lowe's because we have a few things we need to get oh. there so we can find out the gift card total. And then do you think we could spend the 90 cents off this one and that sort of thing? I don't know, like sometimes the reason that that amount is on there because you can't like use it unless it's the full we'll amount. Buy one of... screw at Lowe's, 90 cents. We do need a screw. We do. <laughs> um, and then I have two Buffalo Wild Wings with $8.70 and the other one is $8.01. That is amazing. Okay, ready? Okay, I'm going to give you a challenge, okay? You hold this. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna hold this up and you tell me about the gift card date. Okay. So first? First we go to Buffalo Wild Wings on a Tuesday and we get half price wings and $16 is plenty to feed us for that. Okay, and then? And then... We go to, okay, 207, what do we do with 207? We go to McDonald's uh -huh. and we get two ice creams. Okay. Okay. 90 cents. 90 cents. This is a visa, so it can go anywhere. This is where we go to Lowe's and get a screw. Okay. <laughs> and then we have a Lowe's gift card. And hopefully we can purchase other things that we need at Lowe's. Uh-huh. And, and then, then we have a Gap gift card for $8.19. We go and look at the clearance section at Gap. Yes. And then the big whopper, 2307. It can be spent anywhere. Oof. What are we gonna do? What, what are we gonna we, do? What do we do? You what decide. Do? You decide the Everybody's last part watching. of the day. You decide. Um. I I got one. Okay, go. We go to Home Goods. Oh. For the house. Yes. All right. Let's do it. Let's go right now. Right now, I think <laughs> stores are probably closed. <laughs> oh man. Well, guys, maybe that's our date tomorrow. You'll have to tune in and find out. And but. As always, we'll see you tomorrow. Good night, you guys. Good night. And where's Ollie? Oh, he's up on his bed. Oh, good night, Poodle Noodle. We'll see you tomorrow.